friends. Happy Thursday. Welcome back to my channel. Sally Hearts Jack 80 here. How are my lovely subbies today? How's my YouTube family on this fabulous Thursday? This throwback Thursday. This Friday Eve. <laughs> I bet some of you thought I was going to forget about throwback Thursday today, huh? Some of you thought I was going to forget about you, but I couldn't. I absolutely couldn't. I love doing throwback Thursday. And I love, love, love having you guys a part of my YouTube family and my journey. And I gotta say, before I get on with Throwback Thursday, thank you all so much for your wonderful suggestions from Tuesday's video of should I sell on eBay or not to eBay or not to eBay. You guys gave me some really, really good ideas, some really good suggestions, and I'm definitely, I haven't decided what I'm gonna do yet or if I'm gonna do a few of the suggestions or what, but I don't think eBay is going to be one of them. But thank you guys so much for that. I knew if I shouted it out to you guys, to my friends, to my lovey subbies, to my family, you guys would have come through. So thank you guys so much for that. So today is Throwback Thursday, so we are getting in our time machines. Well, wait, wait, I rushed it. I rushed it. I'm so excited I rushed it. So you know what that means. It is time for another Throwback Thursday doll review. Ah! And today we are getting into our time machines and we're going back to the year of 1988 when this fabulous group of dolls was on toy shelves. I am so happy I still have my Barbie doll, but I am extra happy that I get to add this girl to my collection, and it is Animal Lovin' Nikki. Ah! Love, love, love these dolls when I was little. Glad that I love that they came with a little, little pet. As you can see in her box, it says she has her own lion cub to care for and love. Ah! On the side of the box, you get two pictures. She's taking care of her lion cub. And then down there, you get another picture of where she's wearing her dazzling safari look. And I love the back of the box because it shows you everything in the collection. You have Ken, you have Nikki, and of course Barbie, and then you get a plush giraffe too in the set named ZZ. Super, super, super adorable and cute. I still have my Barbie. She's in my um, case where all my other Barbies are, but I am super, super excited to open this doll. The reason why I have this doll to share with you guys today on this fabulous Throwback Thursday is my little sister found this for me at a yard sale. I did not go to the yard sale. She went to the yard sale. She absolutely, I can't believe she picked this out for me and knew that I would want it. But she absolutely came through and got me this Animal Lovin' Nikki. So what I'm going to do, you guys, is I'm going to take Animal Lovin' Nikki out of her box and I will be right back to give you all a closer look. <laughs> Okay, lovey subby. So here is the fabulous animal, animal, animal loving Nikki out of her box. Look at that beautiful, beautiful Miko, Kira, Nikki face mold. Super, super gorgeous. This mold should never go away ever. It is such a beautiful mold. There she is in her fabulous safari fashion, getting ready to go out into the safari with this cute little outfit on. But before I get to Kira and I, Kira, see I'm calling her Kira, before I get to Nikki in this set, I want to show you some of the things that she came with and some of the things I miss from growing up with Barbie in the 80s because it was such a great time for Barbie. Um, not only do you get this colorful, colorful box with this colorful background where Nikki was held in place, um, you also get these cool sheets of cutouts to help her on her safari journey. And they come with a canteen, a pair of binoculars, a compass, a map. And down here, you even get a passport and Nikki's passport. See her little photo right there? Super, super cute. Another thing I love from this time period is you also get this fold-out Barbie um, huge... Uh, what's it called um like a collection of things that Mattel has to offer from the world of Barbie in here and it's super super huge 
and it's just really, really cool. And I love how it's double-sided. And all these things you were able to find at your local store where they sold toys and they sold Barbie to add to your collection. You are also able to send this in and become a part of the Barbie fan club and you receive the Barbie magazine four times a year. I remember I did this once. Really, really cool. I totally miss this stuff. And nowadays, Barbie does not have any of this in her packaging. And I also miss the beautiful, beautiful pink boxes and the photographs of the dolls in the back, which Mattel, I think, still does. But it's just really, really cute. And some of the reasons why I really, really love my 80s Barbie, besides the fact that I grew up with her. Um, so let's get to the things that Nikki came with. Here is her plastic little lion cub. <laughs> that she could take care of and hold in her arms. She comes with this fabulous retro Barbie brush. You guys all know this brush. And then here is the doll. She is gorgeous. I love her hair. She has um, two-toned hair. It's black and it's brown. She has it in two parted ponytails in the front and then it is short and wild in the back. I need to brush it. I love her earrings. They are giraffes with the heart in, I mean, behind them. Cute. She comes with the scarf. This animal print halter top. It's really, really cute. And this circle skirt, mini skirt that she is going to wear out in the safari. Because let me tell you, when you are in the safari, you want to wear a mini skirt and these really cute pink hiking boots. But along with the mini skirt, what I love is she has purple matching underoos because why not? You got to match, right? And I also, did I say that she has the cute little scarf and she's wearing a ring, which I also love about Barbies. Back in the day, they always came with a ring and earrings on, which I thought was really, really cool. And I always was paranoid because I tried so hard not to to lose them. But she is a beautiful, beautiful doll. I love this face sculpt. I love that she's on the classic Barbie body with the bendy knees. So great. And you can tell this Barbie has some, um, what's that called? Weight to her, which is really, really cute. I love, love, love this doll. And she's super, super beautiful. And I'm so happy to add her to my Barbie collection. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching today's Throwback Thursday. This has been my review of 1988's Animal Lovin' Nikki doll from the Animal Lovin' Barbie collection. Super, super great. If you guys get an opportunity to add this girl to your collection, I definitely give her a billion thumbs up because she is a really cute and beautiful, fabulous doll. So thank you guys so much for watching today's show. I hope you enjoyed it. I enjoy Throwback Thursday. So who am I kidding? I enjoy every show that I do throughout the week. So thank you guys once again. Remember to love your family, love your friends, but most importantly, love yourself. Be kind, stay positive, and until we meet again in this fabulous... Nikki Doll Wonderful World. <laughs> you guys have a magical day. And I will see you tomorrow for Friday's show. Have fun out there, guys, and continue to enjoy the rest of your Thursday. Thank you. Bye-bye.